Let's go check underneath the lift again. So first thing we find is a whole bunch of different ski passes. I don't know how you drop this off the lift. I found this ski pass to a different resort. We're not even part of the Icon Pass. Don't know how this ended up here. Then we found this weird Chewbacca thing. Then we found two different ski poles. How you drop your ski pole off the lift and don't get it, I have no idea. Then we find a whole bunch of alcohol. I don't want to meet the person who got iced with that. Probably carry them down later that day. Then we found an entire bottle of Hennessy. You guys are out here wilding at our resort. Crazy. Found this completely unopened thing though of lemonade. Should I drink it or not? Then we start finding vapes. So many vapes. You guys need to stop vaping. It's not good for you. Then uh, we find our first phone of the day, which had their contact information in, which is great. We're able to return that to them. Thought, found the AirPods in it, and then found some trauma shears. What do you? What the fuck? Yes. <laughs> Here are five tips to get into park skiing. If you've ever skied into a park or buy one, you've probably seen this bright orange sign that says Park Smart. Let's talk about it. The S stands for start small. It's pretty common sense. That means step foot into a park that's for your ability that has the smaller features or the features that are meant for your riding level. P.S. You're way more likely to meet friends and people that ski your ability if you're in the right park. So trust me, you want to do that. The M means make a plan. Know your line, know where you're going. It's really important to know where you are so you're not standing in front of a feature or in a landing. Always look before you drop. It's for your own safety and other people's safety. And it's part of park etiquette. I know you don't want to be a snake. The R stands for respect. So be respectful of others. Be encouraging. Don't be an asshole. Don't snake. Don't stand on the features. Side hit features. Or stand in the landing. Just know where you're at. The T means take it easy. Again, just know your limits at all times. Let me know your questions in the comments. Watch this, y'all. It's my hidden talent. Oh, you want me to do it again? You're out with your pool car and dog and scorching hot sun and you don't have your baseball cap. Uh, you work what you have. Am I upset? No, I am not. A little, but... So we have our snowmaking pond here, as you can tell. It is getting pretty close to uh, overflowing, so I'm gonna have to go open the dam. So all this water is actually going over the top of the dam and there's a boat stuck in the dam. We're gonna have to go ahead and remove the boat as our first step. So that is what we are doing here. I almost didn't fall in there. Got the boat out. Then we start raising the dam. Keep raising it. Now it's flowing. It's been about an hour, and now uh, let me show you where the water level is now. It was all the way up here, and now it's all the way down there. So, open that dam definitely helped.